Hey guys, it's Brie the Coupon Queen. Welcome back to my channel. So now we're gonna go over the Walgreens must-do deals starting next week. The current week, I did two amazing hauls, got over $100 each haul, completely free and a moneymaker using Ibotta. I went on, what was that, Wednesday and got the rack in the cash bonus. I finally completed that, giving me $30 cash back on that haul, which is absolutely amazing. So if you've missed any of the videos that I've done this week, they will be linked at the end, so definitely check them out. Tons and tons of deals and ways that you can save the current week. So now we wanna start getting ready for next week. There is the talks of the new program that is gonna be coming out. So as I get more and more details, I will do a video on it for you guys. I just don't wanna do a video without having all of the answers and then kind of mess it up. So that is what I am waiting on. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for tuning in. Take a second, hit that red subscribe button and the notification bell. So when I do post some new deals or videos that you can take advantage of, you guys will be notified and you won't miss out. I also posted a video on top cash back. So as you guys start shopping for any of your holiday decorations, your Halloween costumes, your Thanksgiving things, Christmas shopping, things like that, you can do it online through Top Cash Back and get some cash back as you're shopping as well right from home. So super easy. I did a video and with my link, you can get $10 back when you spend 25 for new users. So that expires on November 30th. So definitely take advantage of that before it's gone. So let's go ahead and dive into the deals for next week. We had tons of boosters for the current week and we have some boosters for next week. So one booster I have is if you go to your coupon folder, you will see them. Some accounts vary. Not every account gets these, unfortunately. It is for spend 20, get 5,000 points, and it's a digital booster. It says sneak peek because it won't be available and valid until next week. So it'll start on Sunday, go through the following Saturday. Where I find them, I just went to my coupon folder on the app, scrolled down until I saw one, if it was available, and then I clipped it. You definitely want to clip it. It will disappear. Sometimes there's a limit on how many people can clip it. So if you don't, it can disappear and then you'll miss out. So stay tuned till the end. I have two different scenarios for using that spend booster, one paying with points and one paying without. So very beginner friendly. I do have some other unique boosters that I got. Here's a clip of a couple of them. Finished products, it says 1,500 bonus points with membership. So they're saying with membership, and I know that references their new program coming up. So I have all these clipped on my account, and they're not valid starting until the 19th, as you can see. So I can't take advantage of these next week. It would be the following week. And I'm not sure if I have to switch over and sign up for my Walgreens first for these to work. So once I get more information on these different unique boosters, I will definitely let you know as well. So keep an eye out on your accounts. If you have them, again, clip them. You can always unclip a coupon at Walgreens. I did show how at the end of my Walgreens haul video that I posted on Wednesday. You cannot unclip it from a computer. You have to use your app. So the first deal I want to share with you is on some laundry products. We have buy four, get a $6 register reward, and you can mix and match Downy, Tide, and Bounce. And they're all $4.99 each. So one scenario, you can grab two of the Tide Liquid at $4.99 each, one of the Downy, and one of the Tide Pods. For coupons in our PG insert, we have a $2 Tide Liquid and a $2 Tide Pods. We also have... $2 Tide Liquid and Tide Pod digital coupons. You're gonna wind up paying $13.96, getting back a $6 register reward, making your final cost $7.96 for four or $1.99 each. Make sure you submit your receipt to pggoodeveryday.com so you can get 50 points per P&G product and you can submit up to three receipts per day. 
Now, if you like some secret Old Spice Gillette deodorant, the Old Spice body wash is included as well. They're two for $11, and when you buy four of them, you're gonna get back 7,000 points. So one scenario I put together, you can grab two of the Gillette deodorant for $11, two of the secret deodorant for $11 as well. That'll bring you to $22. We have a dollar off two Gillette coupon in our PG insert from two weeks ago and a dollar off of two for the secret. You'll be left to pay $20, get back 7,000 points, making your final cost $13 for all four or $3.25 each. And you can pay with points on this deal because it is a buy deal, not a spend deal. At the end, again, I will explain how you can use points on a spend deal. If you're new or beginning to coupon at Walgreens and it's confusing for you, then what I would recommend is just not using points for a spend deal. That way you don't have any issues at checkout. Halloween candy. So I stocked up this week. I got some on Wednesday at Walgreens and on Monday at Walgreens. So you're going to see a lot of Halloween candy deals at Walgreens and CVS. So definitely keep an eye out so you can stock up for Halloween. Reese's snack size candy are just $1.99 each next week. And we're getting a dollar off of two digital coupon. Your final cost for grabbing two of them is gonna be $2.98 for both or $1.49 each, which is cheaper than Walmart. So definitely a great place to grab some candy. Schick Disposable Razors, this is an amazing, amazing deal. Razors are super expensive and next week they're gonna be just $5.99. We are only getting one insert on Sunday, a 1011 smart source insert, but I highly recommend purchasing that insert. A lot of you ask how I've been getting my coupons early. I order from bqsavings.com. It's listed in the bottom of all my description boxes as well if you ever forget, so you can always check back, but Sometimes you can get your coupons super early and then you can use them for deals the current week, which makes deals even better. So that is how I got my You Buy Kotex coupons early. I got these Schic disposable razors early and I was using them even the current week for some additional deals. So if you guys have any questions on that, you guys can go to bqsavings.com and order your coupons there if you want. So what we're gonna do is grab two of the disposable razors. Again, you can mix and match. They're $5.99 each. We are getting $4 off one coupons in our smart source insert. We're also gonna be getting a digital coupon. So you can use one of each if you're only gonna be getting one insert. I believe the limit is two. You'll pay $3.98, get back 2,000 points, making your final cost the, um, no, yeah, that is right. Making your final cost $1.99 for both or 99 cents each. To go along with the razors, we have some Edge Shave Gel. The Schick or Skin Timit are included as well. They're gonna be all $2.99 next week and we're getting dollar off coupons in our insert. We're again gonna be getting a digital coupon for a dollar off. So when you buy two, you're gonna get back 2,000 points. So grabbing two of them will bring you to 598. Using two of the dollar off one coupons, you'll pay 398, get back 2,000 points, making your final cost just 99 cents each. I did check Ibotta, Edge is not included at Walgreens. Typically, it's included at Walmart. So stay tuned, that could be a really great deal. Usually, we'll get a dollar back from Ibotta on Edge Shave Gel. So we'll have to wait for next week and see what kind of rebates we have that we can combine with this. Mitchum deodorant, this is a great deal. We have a digital coupon that we're getting as well, tons and tons of digital deals. So if you're not getting an insert or if you get an insert and it doesn't have some of these coupons, don't worry, you can still take advantage of these deals at Walgreens. So grabbing just one of the deodorants at $2.99, you can either use the digital coupon or a dollar off coupon in the smart source insert. Your final cost is just going to be $1.99.
So now I wanna go over the two scenarios I have for that spend 20, get 5,000 points digital booster. Scenario one is not using any points to pay, just using register rewards and cash, credit, debit, you name it. So what you can do is that Tide deal, grab two Tide liquid and two Tide pods. Then you're gonna grab one Mitchum deodorant at 299. Remember, for these spend boosters, your total has to be $20 on the dot or more to trigger getting those points back. If you just picked up four of the Tide, that would bring you to 1996, and you're not at $20, you would not get the 5,000 points back. That's why I went ahead and added the Mitchum deodorant. So that'll bring you to $22.95 plus taxes. The coupons you're gonna wanna use, again, the $2 Tide liquid from the PG, $2 Tide pods from the PG insert, you can also print them from pgeveryday.com. You get one print per month per account. And when you print them, they have an expiration date of 24 hours. So I highly recommend just printing them the day you're gonna use them. That way they don't expire on you because you're not gonna be able to print them again. We also have $2 Tide Liquid and Tide Pod digital coupons and a dollar Mitchum um, coupon, you can use the digital or from the smart source insert. That'll total $9 in coupons. Here is the final breakdown. I'm missing an X right there, but it's supposed to be a total of $22.95 plus tax. Then you're going to take off your coupons of $9. You'll be left to pay $13.95 plus taxes. You can use register rewards, of course, to lower your out of pocket cost, but Every item that we purchased does have a coupon already attaching. So any register reward you're wanting to use, you will have to add a filler item. Then you're gonna get back $6 register reward from the Tide deal and 5,000 points from that booster, making your final cost $2.95 plus taxes for five items or 59 cents each. So now for advanced couponers at Walgreens, for this deal, you could roll $2 in points and you would still get back the 5,000 points because you would still be spending $20.95 plus taxes if you rolled 2,000 points. So if you wanna do that, you can. And then of course, if you wanna use some register rewards, I don't even have any register rewards right now. So I am gonna be doing the next scenario and rolling some points to be able to keep my out-of-pocket super low. So here is the more advanced option, again, paying with points. So there's two ways to think about it. Um, it just depends on kind of what clicks for you. The first way you can think about it, so you have to spend $20 uh, before taxes and after any Walgreens IVC coupons. So a Walgreens IVC coupon is like the $1.25 coupon for the Scott. Any digital coupon that says with card is a Walgreens store coupon. So for the $20 spend amount, you have to reach that using coupons, cash, you can use register rewards or whatever. So like in the last example, if your total is $22.95, your spend amount has to be at least 20. So if I roll 2000 points, I'm still now spending $20.95. Then we're using coupons and cash to pay the rest. That is how that works. The other way you can do it or think about it is if you rack up your total to get $20 of coupons, then you're still hitting that $20 mark. And anything after that, you can use points to pay with it. So that is why our total on this is so high. So let's go through this example real quick. Again, do the Tide deal for the laundry products, two of the Tide liquid, $4.99 each, and two of the Tide pods. Then we're gonna throw in that Chic disposable razor deal. Remember, it was buy two, get 2,000 points, and they're $5.99 each. Two of the Edge shave gel, they were also buy two, get 2,000 points, and those are $2.99 each. Two of the Reese's candy, the snack size, they're $1.99 each and one of the Mitchum deodorant for $2.99. Our total comes out to $44.89 of products. 
These are the coupons. So we have the Tide coupons again, the two $4 Schick disposable coupons, or you could use a digital, the $2 Edge coupons from the Smart Source. There is also a dollar digital, the dollar off of two Reese's digital, and the dollar Mitchum deodorant coupon from the Smart Source or the digital coupon. That brings our coupons to $20. So bam, right there, we hit our spend amount. So now anything after that, we can roll points and we'll still get back the 5,000 points. And all of this is gonna be going away soon. So you don't have to worry about it for too much longer. So if you have any questions though, of course, drop a comment. I will do the best I can to help you guys out. So the final breakdown, total again, 44.89. Taking off the $20 in coupons, you're left to pay $24.89. So you can roll $20 in points, you'll pay $4.89 plus taxes out of pocket. Then you're gonna get back 5,000 points for the digital booster, 2,000 points for the Schick Razor deal, 2,000 points from the Edge Gel deal, and a $6 register reward from the Tide and the Laundry deal, making your final cost $9.89 for 11 items or 90 cents each. Definitely an amazing, amazing deal. We got razors in here. We have laundry products in this deal. For 90 cents each, you cannot beat that. So for the register reward as well, make sure the Catalina machines are working at your store. Three weeks ago, I went to a store that it's still been broken for like four months now. And I went there, tried to call customer service. They wouldn't give me the points back. I had to contact the Catalina company. It was a nightmare. I still don't have my register rewards. So Lord knows if I'll ever even see those. And I was totally over it. So what I would recommend, if the store Catalina machines are not working, Ask the manager, can you just give me 6,000 points for that instead? And see if you can handle it and resolve it in store so you don't have to worry about contacting Walgreens customer service. Even their live chat has been giving me issues the last two weeks when I have digitals not coming off. So to help prevent any stress or any headaches, I would recommend seeing if the managers in store will help you. Or go to a location that you know the Catalina machine is working. Don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up for me. Share it with your friends and family. So if they're trying to stock up on some products as well, of course they can. Use those savings to start stocking up for the holidays and grabbing some gifts. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.